originally uh, the We Want Miles exhibit that's here in Montreal now, it uh, started in Paris at a place called La Cité de la Musique. And the people there asked me if I would do a concert in conjunction with the exhibit, you know, to honor Miles. And they said, we would like you to play the music from Tutu, you know. And at first I didn't think it was a good idea because Miles wasn't the kind of guy who liked to look backwards. But then I decided maybe I could try with young musicians who maybe could bring something new to the music. I thought Miles would like that. So that's what we did. And it was just supposed to be for the exhibit. But my promoter asked a couple of uh, other promoters in Europe whether they'd be interested. And next thing I knew, we had a three-month tour of Tutu Revisited. And so this show now is the first gig of the second tour. How do you connect with these young lions? Uh, you know, they... Um, they're great musicians, you know. The only thing that I try to do is show them how, how to play together as a group, you know, and how maybe to create a bigger emotion, you know, because sometimes musicians, that you learn that later, you know, with experience. So I just try to show them, you know, how, uh, how it all works together. Bill. Not that they need much direction, but just, you know, push them in this direction or that direction. What appealed to you in that particular style of playing when you took it up? The slap took the bass from the back of the band and put it in the front of the band. Simple as that, you know, because it was dynamic and it was exciting, you know. And as a young kid, you hear the bass being played like that, you go, oh, I'm doing that, you know, uh, particularly since no one was playing the electric bass like that before. So Larry Graham really excited all, not just me, all the kids who were playing bass at the time. The difference for me, I think, is that I took that style and brought it into different areas. I brought it into jazz, you know, and I brought it into more pop situations. Mm -hmm. 